Do you want to know how to speed bridge? Yes, Canadian, I do want to know how to speed bridge. Do you suck at speed bridging? Oh, yes, Canadian, I do suck at speed bridging. Are you trash at Bedwars? Oh, yes, Canadian, I have trash at Bedwars and I suck at life. Well, today, ladies and gentlemen, I got the best video for you. Today, I'm going to be teaching you guys how to speed bridge and how to become a Bedwars pro. I did a video on this a couple of days ago, but now we are going to be doing a full guide on how to speed bridge here in Bedwars. I am only a 13 star, but I'm a bit of a noob. But I know so many people that play this game mode that don't even know how to speed bridge and they're like 300 star and it's so so easy to do and by the way guys if you want more bedwars content just make sure you leave a like and a comment down below let's aim for over 350 likes and let's just hop into today's video the first thing y'all gotta do guys is before you hop into a bedwars game so you want to go into housing before you hop into a bedwars game and just start bridging and trying to speed bridge and trying to master it first before you go into an actual game this is actually one of the main ways i actually got better speed bridging so i highly encourage this but guys, enough chitter chatter. It's time to hop in Bed Wars and slay some people out. So I know a lot of you guys that are going to be searching up this content will be looking for how to speed bridge automatically. So I'm going to get that out of the way before I actually play the game. So there's a couple of things you want to do before you want to master the speed bridge techniques. So first of all, you're going to have to have like a somewhat good keyboard. Honestly, having a good keyboard helps a lot and gets me in a rhythm. So like I swear, guys, I used to have the worst keyboard ever and I was terrible at speed bridging. I got Black Widow and I automatically got like 10 times better. No cap, no cap, no cap. Who wants to do a normal bridge like this when you can do... Papa Americano. You know, you can do a bridge like this. It's super easy. So there's a couple things you guys want to master before you start speed bridging. First of all, you want to make sure you right click synchronize with your shift. So you want to synchronize both of them together. So as you guys see, I'm synchronizing my bridge and you don't want to jitter click at all. A lot of people try to jitter click when they speed bridge and you just want to time your right click with your shift and you want to make sure that they're alternating. You don't want both of them to go at the same time because then it's going to script your speed bridge and then you're just going to stutter and then you're just going to stop. So you don't want to do that at all. I'm going to destroy this guy's bed real quick because screw him. Oh my God. I actually I haven't played this map ever by the way so this is new to me i'm quickly just gonna get an iron sword i'm gonna get some tnt there we go i got some tnt and some wolf i don't even feel like protecting the bed by the way i feel like i'm good enough to the point where i don't even need to do that but as you guys see but as you guys see you need to synchronize your shift button and your right click together so i'm gonna make an example over here while bridging the this guy so you want to make sure you're so again you want to make sure your right click and your shift is alternating together you want to make sure you don't right click and shift at the same time because if you do that you're gonna fail bridging so that's the first step, guys. You don't want to do that. And it's all about getting into a rhythm. Once you first start doing it, it gets so, so easy. As you saw, as you guys see, we've become the bomber man. We have three TNT, a gabble. We have everything we need to take these two teams out. Looks like both of them are just chilling at their bases. So we're going to have to do something about it. All right, guys. The prey's nearby. The prey is throwing fireballs at us. He's literally... Oh, my God. Jesus Christ. Jesus Christ, oh lady, oh my god. All right, guys, we sadly lost this game, but as I said, I'm not the Bed Wars player. We're gonna play another one, see if we can win it. Again, I'm telling you guys to take advice from a noob like me just because I suck at the game, and if I can do it, anyone can do it. That's what I mean. So last game, guys, we weren't trying because I was trying to explain to you the guy and everything, but now we are on one of the best maps ever in Bed Wars. I'm gonna slay everyone. I'm pretty sure this is a new map too, so this helps a lot also. But I'm gonna slay everyone out, use my speed bridging skills, and completely just win this game in like two minutes. Trust, guys. Trust. We have 48 blocks, which means a speed bridge straight to the blue team automatically, guys. You know how we do. Guys, look at how beautiful this is. Look at how beautiful the speed bridge is. It's so beautiful. I just, I just love it. I love it. This guy does literally not expect us to destroy his bed. Bada bing, bada boom. This guy's still trying to get stuff over here. Oh my god, I feel so bad. You don't even know. Bro. Oh, that sucks. He didn't even know that was behind him the whole entire time. So here we go. Okay, we got a TNT. We got a gap. Well, I'm going to actually get enough blocks to actually make a bed protection around my bed. So I can go explore places without worrying about my bed getting destroyed for once. We're building literally the most standard bed defense possible. The most standard wooden bed defense known to man. Here we go. All the blocks there. All the blocks there. Bada bing, bada boom. See, this is how you got to do a bed defense, guys. You literally just have to make it messy and it'll fall into place. Look at how messy this bed is. Look at how messy this setup is. This is how to make a freaking bed defense. Just make an absolute mess of your freaking base. And what do you see here, guys? is the most beautiful defense in bed wars completely fit to defend anything in bed wars absolutely anything this guy by the way green team he did not freaking head oh my god wait blue guy's about to <gasps> blue guy no he stole my bed i want to destroy that come on man i just realized that half these people aren't even protecting their beds at all which is great for me like that's better for me automatically bro wait i see this i see this blue guy you see this guy in my left corner trying to bridge towards me do you guys see him oh my god he does not even think i'm looking at him but i'm literally just gonna come out watch, watch this guys he's gonna come after me wait how close is he okay he He's close enough. Now I come after and I slay him out. I slay him out. I give him the business. The one-two punch. The one-two Mayweather. Yeah, that's right, buddy. Go away. I think this guy went back for more blocks, but yet he doesn't realize that I have an iron sword. Oh my god, he's running away now. He doesn't want this. He doesn't want this. Oh, he has iron armor though. 
He's iron arm. Oh my god, we slay him out. Jesus Christ. Our PvP skills are absolutely unmatched. I told you guys. I'm the best Bed Wars player known to man. I don't think I see any enemies that are bad right now, so I think we're good. There's only about three teams left. I think the team we want to go for is either red team or we want to go for a gray team. One of those two teams. Oh my god, red's bed's literally right over here. We can destroy this really quickly. Bro, look at this lackluster bed defense too. Like, what are you doing, man? What are you doing? And... Bop. You're bad. You're a noob. This is how it's going. You're, you're feeding me diamonds. You're... Oh my... Wait. You're feeding me diamonds. Okay, I'm, I'm still gonna kill you, bud. Thank you for the diamonds, man. I really appreciate that. Thank you for the- How many diamonds did you drop me? Nine diamonds. Okay, rest in peace to uh, JungC1019. If you guys made it to this point in the video, make sure to comment hashtag rest in peace JungC1019 because he was a critical part to give us diamonds in today's video. I might as well buy sharpened swords and also I'm gonna get some reinforced armor because why not? I have so many diamonds at this point. This guy had so much gold too, that allows us to get freaking iron armor. There we go, we're fully freaking decked out, boys. I might as well just get another TNT. I'm gonna get another Gapple, there we go. And now I think we're fully set up to win this game. There's like no other way for us to lose this, unless our bed gets destroyed right now. I don't see anyone in our bed. Okay, that's a good sign. Bro, 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 wait, wait, please, please. Please. Oh my god, this gray guy's coming over here. Someone's throwing mad arrow shots over here, and those are getting awfully close. And we have such good stuff that I don't really want to risk it all. All right, guys, we're going full send it. Full send right here. Guys, watch this. Watch this. All right, come on. Go. Bro, oh my god, we are so good at this game. We are so good at this game. Oh, wait, you got an end stone over there. That's not good. Destroy your bed. I right, bada bing guy. Bro, piss off. Bro, this guy's awful PvP too. I think the last guy we're supposed to kill is this white guy. And after that, I think we should be good. And he literally has no bed defense at all. He's a freaking bow and arrow. So what he's probably going to do is... He wait, wait. Hi. I give you win? Oh my god. Guys. I don't ever want to see you guys ever suicide like that ever again. When you play Bed Wars... Suicide is not the option. Don't be like this guy over here. He's a sad player. 